have to eat the dream. You have to sleep the dream. You have to dream the What's dream. What's going on, Strand Team family? Look, I'm right back with another great video. If you're new to the Strand Team family, welcome to the Strand Team family. All we do over here is get gains. If you have any video suggestions or any video requests, all you gotta do is put them at the bottom and I promise you we're gonna make that video happen. You already know we have, ladies and gentlemen. We are doing this barbell only this entire week. My body is beat up, my body is sore. If you are following along with me, listen, I wanna give you two major salutes because these workouts, they look really simple on paper, but they have been highly effective. Now you already know what it is today. Today it is time to blast our legs, our piatinus. So if you ain't scared of it, I know a lot of people don't like to train legs and I'm not about to go into no preaching, but listen, if you ain't scared of it, this leg workout right here, I can guarantee will help you to get stronger, build more thickness, overall size, mass, and just density into your legs. That is way too much talking. So let's jump straight into day number three with the barbell only workouts and we are training legs. The first exercise you already know is going to be the barbell squats. We have five working sets. Now your first set, choose a weight that is challenging for you. Everybody's going to be different strengths, so that's why I always say this. Choose a challenging weight for you that you can get for 10 reps. My weight was 275 pounds. Your second set, choose a heavy and challenging weight for you to get 8 reps. My weight was 315 pounds. Your third set, choose a heavy and challenging weight for you to get 6 reps. My weight was 340 pounds. Now your fourth is going to be your heaviest set. I want you to go as heavy as you possibly can for four good quality reps. My weight was 365 pounds. Now you done worked up to like an extremely heavy four rep max. So now I want you to do a back off set and it's going to be insane. So your fifth and last and final set is going to be one set for 20 total reps. My weight was 225 pounds, and I'm not even going to lie to you. That's why I'm doing the voiceover today instead of last night. It just took me out. Like, <laughs> it took me so long to regain my composure. It almost felt like my whole body or my soul just left. I, I can't explain it. Like, I felt borderline seasick. Like, that 20 rep set, even though I'm showing you right now on the screen, rep for rep, it looks like it's smooth. I never really start struggling. I was never really even reaching failure, but it was something about this after going extremely heavy, then backing off that weight, and then going and doing 20 consecutive reps. It almost felt like strenuous cardio. <laughs> now, since you're doing uh, your barbell squats, I want you to go ahead and take your time, make your rest periods between two to four minutes. So our next exercise, we have the barbell lunges. I want you to do two to four sets and I want you to choose a weight that is challenging for you to get 8 to 12 reps. My weight was 135 pounds. But like I tell you in every single video, if you are stronger, make sure you go heavier. And if you're not as strong, choose a weight that is challenging for you. Now, you can either do walking lunges, like you know what I mean, take a step and then lunge and take a step and then lunge. But where I'm working out at the house for this whole series, I don't have that space. So I'm doing them stationary, eight to 12 reps. And like I say, do two to four sets. You know, I'm always honest with you guys and you ladies, I only did two. By the time I did my second set, I, my body was just like quit or I'm gonna quit on you. <laughs> and with this, I was only resting between like two minutes. But if you need a little bit more rest, go ahead and make sure you are fully recovered. Now, after we finish with that, we want to give our hamstrings some attention. So we have the barbell stiff leg deadlifts. If you don't want to do this, you're more than welcome to do good mornings. They're both highly effective exercises. But I want you to do two to four sets, and I want you to stay between eight to 12 reps. My weight was 185 pounds. And although my strength is coming back, I probably could do like 225 pounds comfortably. Like I say, this workout just beat me up, guys. So I didn't want to not do it, but at the same time, I didn't want to push it into where I, I was going to have to quit the workout. So I just met myself in the middle and I went with 185 pounds and it was perfect for me. And like when you see when I'm doing this exercise, my back is never rounding. No word throughout the range of motion when you see my back round. My back is staying flat. My back is staying strong. That's going to make sure that you are going to be in a safe position. Now after you finish with that, I got this nice little creative way that you can work your calves with the barbell. We're going to do the barbell, T-bar, landmines, whatever you want to call it, calf raises. We're going to do four to six sets 
and I want you to stay between 20 to 25 reps. Just put a barbell in the corner of your wall, so like where two walls meet together, put your barbell in it, and then on the other end, load up a decent amount of weight, or you don't even really have to go heavy. I only used 45 pounds, and it was perfect for me. But anyways, you're gonna grab the side that you have the weight on, now you're gonna pick it up and get into like a landmine pressing position. Now just take one or two steps backwards and now it's gonna put your body at an angle. Now you're gonna be leaning towards the weight. So it's gonna make you have more resistance in your leg calves. And now from that position, just go ahead and stand up on the top of your toes and squeeze your calves. Now come back down, stand all the way back up and squeeze your calves. Every single rep, that's all I want you to focus on. Now I only did four sets, but I did 25 reps on all four sets. And guys, by the third and the fourth set, by the time I got to like my 15th or 16th rep, my calves were on fire. This angle doesn't really show it, but my calves are growing, guys. Now, that's the thing about videos. Like, a lot of different angles makes a person look bigger or smaller, taller or shorter. And it just seems like every angle that I can find for my calves, my calves just always look small. In front of them, behind them, beside them, above them, they all just look small. But listen, that's it. This workout took like an hour and 15 minutes because, like I told you earlier, the squats just took everything out of me. But this workout is really great. You can do this at the the gym you can do it at your home gym wherever you are training all you need is a barbell and just a little bit of weight and let's say you don't have enough weight to truly challenge you let's say that you can maybe get 50 percent of your actual working weight just do more reps but i'll see you guys and ladies right back tomorrow we got a nice nice very nice shoulder workout and i know you're going to love it this week has been gain certified and we're going to keep on just pushing it we're going to push it every single day until this week is over but like i take every single video make sure you like this video make sure you share this video but at the end of the day make sure you keep getting them gains <laughs> oh.